What's up guys? Guitar Rock here. So they have a new set item revision of all the new most of the new set items. So they fixed some of the broken ones and we're gonna have a look at it now. So the first one that they change is the slot one set item called unassailable. So this thing Previously, it has increases aggro by 50%, but they reduce it to 40% now, which is a slight nerf. And the max HP increased by 8% is a huge nerf. Previously, it was 18%, so they reduce it to 8%, which I think is a much more fair amount, considering this is only a slot 1, which means it's a 1 star set item. And besides, it has the immune to push and pull effect, which is very good. So, having this set item is immune to Lily, Lily, Deimos. But I'm very curious if it works against Persona or not. Because Persona is not really push or pull, his second skill is more like swapping around with another character. So, I think he might get away with it. This. The side effect here might not block Persona's second skill, but I'm not too sure. Hopefully someone will test that out and post in the Reddit soon enough. So, another nerf is the Iron Fist from the East. So this thing previously has increased crit damage by 15%. So they reduced the number to crit damage by 5%. So that's a 10% reduction, which is a lot. And increases attack if you have three piece it increase attack by eight percent and previously was fifteen percent so that's almost half reduction right there and counter damage previously was fifty percent now it reduces to forty percent so it feels more balanced but still a decent set it's a decent outer space replacement Although you will need to use a couple of shields to get it to work. But since this is another slot 1 set item, yeah, you can. It gives you the flexibility in slot 3 if you are going for a counter build. Alright, so slot 2, 6 star, the immortal. So by equipping 2 pieces, this thing allows you to move through enemies. So previously, this thing was OP as shit, <laughs> it removes one debuff casted every turn. So that, is no, that effect is no longer there, it's now replaced by increased direction strategy advantage by 9% and increases movement by 1. So previously it was remove one debuff and increase movement by 1 every turn which is super freaking shit broken that I don't think a set like that should ever exist I mean this is way way more balanced but I think they nerf it too much like I know the previous one is like a godlike stats but you know the reduction is so much I'm not sure if the direction strategy advantage by 9% Will benefit much but the two piece set effect is very good it allows you to move through enemies so this immortal set got an extremely big nerf so next is the poker faced gambler so this skill this set item will only activate upon casting skills on enemy and <coughs> Previously, there's a 5% chance of ignoring 1200 defense for one turn. And now, that 1200 defense is reduced to 1100. So very very slight nerf, not much. I wouldn't say it make any difference at all. And 
if you have three pieces previously there's a 40% chance of attack increased by 45% and now that 45% is reduced by 40% so 5% reduced in attack for one turn which is a very very slight nerf compared to the others so this one is just a very minor nerf I believe so let's have a look at the next one so slot 4 6 star elemental knight okay so this thing let's see previously <laughs> uh -huh, this yeah I gotta admit the previous one was broken the original one was to increase attack by 4850 if you have two pieces and right now it is reduced to increase attack by 2820 so from 4800 to 2800 there's like 2000 reduction which is a lot so three pieces the previous one increases HP by 15,860 while the current one only increases HP by 8,150 that's almost half reduced and resistance is also reduced by half, uh, five percent. Previously it was thirty percent, now it's twenty five percent. So yeah, the elemental knight got a very very big nerf. It's much much more balanced now. Four thousand attack is just ridiculous. All right, so one more is the slot for Wind Walker. <coughs> so this set item is only for balanced type character. Increases movement by 1 and final skill power by 18%. Previously it was 20%. So a reduction of 2%, which is not much. I don't think it matters that much. Alright, let's have a look at this slot 5 Stone Monkey's Treasure. Okay. So, previously, this set item increases the wearer's defense by 3% of its current HP, up to 4000. So right now that is reduced to 2%, and if you have 3 pieces, the previous stat increases the wearer's attack by 3% of its current HP, and now it's reduced to 2%. So the maximum limit is still 4,000 and 10,000 but as opposed to 3% on of defense and 3% of attack, it's now reduced to 2%. This is a decent set for Valkyrie, I believe. She's the ideal candidate for this set but we'll have to see at the set items typing whether it's a sword, brooch or ring. <coughs> So, one more nerf for the unprecedented slot 5. So, cast a shield at the beginning of each turn to decrease all damage by 10% once. So, that one has no change. So, the previous 3 piece set effect was to increase attack by 20%. At the start of every turn, cast double attack effect at 40% chance. That deals additional damage equal to 35% of casted skill. So previously it was increases attack by 20% and now it's reduced to increases attack by 10%. That's quite a huge nerf as well. And the last one, Prisoner of Avicii Hell. So this is like another Gold Tiger set. Activates when survive alone. So previously this thing increases HP by 50% and ignore enemy's defense by 2000. So now it receives a buff in terms of the increased HP up to 90% but it ignores enemy's defense by 1400 which is a reduction of 600 compared to the previous one. So 3 piece previously it increases attack by 80% and decrease incoming crit damage by 20% so now it decreased inc incoming crit damage by 10% so the increased attack is still same 80% but 
but the decrease crit damage is reduced by half which is quite significant <laughs> alright so quite a lot of changes in the set item revision hope you guys enjoy the quick brief through I'm still waiting for the maintenance to finish that's it for the video guys bye